Okay, so before I go back upstairs, let's just confirm. Everything here is lock, not lock, keyable. Lock, 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 Third, third floor is is where my attention is going, mm -hmm. and um, maybe we maybe we kill dog and and take our time fighting and reading. Maybe we do it the bullshit way. Mm -hmm. Hit that save and and, and be stupid. Wow! 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 Okay. Feels wrong, though, doesn't it? Feels incorrect. The power of gun. Strap with the pipe. Still punching. Or oh, that the dog is taking it. <laughs> Reload. Okay, that's one. Where the big boy go? Moving, keep moving. Please fall. Uh oh, big reload. Come on, go down. Yes, stop it. In the nuts, I'ma stop him in the nuts! Stop him in the nuts! I'ma stop him in the nuts! That's a, that's a straight kick! <laughs> Dealt. Right in the jewel. And it only cost 15 shots? 6 plus probably 10? I had 34 bullets before. Oh, well, I picked up some. Alright. We're still doing alright. Once in a while. We're still doing all right. Now we can read. Take your time. Uh-huh, red crescent and a round dent. Something is written here in the same color red. Piling up from the 300th day and night from beyond the door, cries of pain are heard. Piling up from the 300th day and night from beyond the door, cries of pain are heard. It's 300th day and night. Well... And the final destination has become real, though not a blessed beginning. Doesn't seem like they're asking us to pull a calendar out, but if so... Uh, at a glance, 65 back from December 31st is probably um, October? October 25th or so, give or take? Yeah. I mean, if we're going with a calendar, right? If that's what they're asking, but it doesn't seem like it, they are. Could be 300 day from a, a random event. Could be. Could be. <sighs> Room for something. Nope. Well, I'm sure it'll be Crescent Moon, Iori related, whenever the time comes. Hey, do you have a... F no, you don't have a reload on the... On the in in game, do you? It automatically did it when I ran low. So, oh okay. But we got a lot of bullets, so I'm gonna just walk with the clock. Right, everything here was locked. A side door here. Oh. Oh yeah. Ooh, we're hurting a little bit, huh? Pale yellow. Oh. 
bathroom. Anything in here? Mm, when I came last time, it didn't. Um, I, I got no prompts in this bathroom. Okay, then. It's, it's weird that it's open with nothing to do. Yeah. Is that something on the wall there? No. Yeah, I mean, it almost looks like there's something here, but not much. So, um, third floor, puzzle, bottom door over there, locked. Let's go look at that room again, just to see if there's something in it. Who taught you how to shoot, kid? Very good, eh? Good aim. For not using the sights? I mean, sure. Like, when she readies up, she's, yeah, she's just kind of firing loose. Um, the roast dog. We got the key in here. That's what was the main point. This room was locked. Yeah, so this was just about the cooked key. Didn't see anywhere to crack that walnut. Mm. Maybe the steam in the kitchen could help <laughs> with some. I that I'm, you know what I mean. We're getting we're getting real weird and obtuse at this point, but maybe pipe steam will loosen a walnut. <laughs> yeah. No. Unless you got any brighter ideas. Uh, can you crack it open with the pipe? Can you, you combine walnut you cannot, and You pipe? cannot combine weapon. I already went to combine weapon <laughs> walnut with knife if you didn't if you didn't notice. It didn't and uh, it doesn't let you change rows. So you go to combine and you, you, don't, you can't go down to weapons. You have to only scroll in. I see. The same category. Exactly. So items only. Okay. Let's look at that map again. Um, usually it's like a mist door or something. Yeah. So top to bottom. Uh, those are all checked. Scratched. Elevator. Pass through. I mean, the, the most... Like this area feels like... The most like open ish yeah. and new. But we went there for a bit then. And yeah, and then there's something go something off happening with the doors that are not real or whatever. Um and then there's what's happening to the right of those well, like right right to the left of that save file where the escalators are. What is that? It's like it's red, red. But it's not something I checked, I don't think. I think it just kind of did that as I uh, exited or was the door facing let's go let's just go take a look okay that's all I can remember at the moment yeah I'm not sure where to go from here oh and um, just to verify that this still doesn't do anything yeah The fan that I turned off was just for the purposes of uh, getting out of the room. What are you looking at? Oh, the stuff here. Thank you. Nice. Good old head. <laughs> Good old head. So... All right, mental note, despite no circle, this is the walnut steam room. <laughs> <laughs> Stick the walnut in. Yeah. Nothing else it's interesting? Nothing interesting. Oh, well, I'll show you what's interesting, all right. I plug this hole here. I bet you somewhere around the world someone has figured out a way to crack a walnut with steam. 
I bet you that's something. You know what? Mm. Hot take. Walnuts? Not worth the effort. Too much work, and the insides don't even taste as good as the effort that you put in. I kinda agree. I I kinda agree, yeah. Not a, just... Not worth the effort. So many other kind of nuts taste great. Peanuts are fucking great. They're solid. Whether you shell them or not. You gotta work to shell them a little bit, but even if you do, eh, the, they, the taste is worth it. Sunflower seeds, you gross fuckers, get the fuck away from me. You are the nastiest part of, of any sporting event. Uh, you have no respect for your surroundings. And if you are like a sunflower seed dropping pile is like opening your ass and just shitting on the floor. It's like the shopping cart test. You can show me what kind of person and what kind of character you have based on how you handle your sunflower seeds. I see. Yeah, tells a lot about a person. <laughs> you should like spit it in a bag or something dispose of it when you're done right that's fair if your if your plan is the floor will hold my seeds cool when you're leaving pick your shit up even in a public park or something especially in a public park I see That changed something. Zoom in. Locked door. Locked, locked, locked. Can't cross in that room. Fully locked. Well, this is where a short game <laughs> stops being a short game. <laughs> the key is knowing where to go. Then... Just a room with nothing. I think I got some... Like amp, like medicine in here. Or Do you have to put the pendant inside the walnut hole? <laughs> Some kind of Indiana Jones bullshit? Clearly. <laughs> MacGyver. Uh-oh. Okay, so this map was a lie because... Yeah, we tried to go towards the escalator, but... And it's cut off thing. anyways, right? So let's just um, do another little eyeballs-based tour. Yeah, there's nothing up there. Right, there's just a door out. So there's only one door out facing the far distance, but when we look over here, it it's looks the like there's wall. something in between. Yeah. That's what I was getting confused by, because I'm like, I don't remember turning to face that wall at all. Um, so this room is, is not telling us the truth. Now, uh, I'll save it again just so that we can spare ourselves the trip. Were you looking at something there? But, like, I feel like the if any answer to progress is going to come, it'll come from this lie of like a room. near the gurney. Some kind of vice. Use that to crack the walnut. Yeah, the head did turn before. And you did look, right? You did try to look at it. I was pro I was passing, I was pressing the button from over here. Oh. Um, from, like, further up. Not from the, the clean direction. All right. Yeah, and this was the camera change. That there we saw. you go. Okay. That looks almost like a shotgun for a second in the shadows. 
but it's just a belt. All right. That's what we needed. All right, crack that nut. Pearl? An actual nut? Just a, a jewel? jewel? We got a moonstone. And we got a moon door. Uh, okay. What does the... Type of jewel? Not really from the moon. Somewhat... Uh, somehow inside the walnut. <laughs> and now she's looking at the save file, right? Oh no, the door. Okay. All right. Oh boy. Now we're going back to the moon door. Oh, it's everywhere. Yep. Okay. Level two. Yep. Level two unlocked. Walnut has increased the difficulty. <laughs> The difficulty adapted to your <laughs> wits. Adaptive walnut tech. <laughs> we ran through here like at least five times pre walnut. But we have now entered the post walnut timeline. <laughs> Damn. War has changed. <laughs> Wrong one. Wrong one. Oops. So... Far side. Uh... Other way. Oh boy. Right under the big thing. And I don't know what it's gonna take to kill those things yet, but I don't like the speed at which they move. Nor the fact that they're on the walls. Uh, creating... All Something kinds of... Oh, oh yeah. Creating all kinds of problems. Um... Curse for jewel. aiming. But here we are. Uh... Post Walnut World, man. <laughs> uh -huh, another one. Oh. Go down, go down. Did it fart? It sounds a little bit like it did. <laughs> but let's make sure. <laughs> I mean, you're stomping its body out, like... It wouldn't be the, the weirdest thing to expect. Do they have a digestive system? Oh, I mean like i need to see a one silent hill enemy in the bathroom properly using it well here's the problem Lurgy. they didn't until you said that <laughs> glad to help the moment you said it it's that was out there it's, it's part not. of your psyche and now it's gonna happen <laughs> growling growling No more action, right? Save. The world has, has, has updated, mm -hmm. lest we forget. Post-nut clarity. <laughs> <laughs> 
Walnut Mancy. <laughs> All right. Please open that moon door. A moonstone. Yes. I stuck the moonstone into the door. Loading. Third floor. Mm-hmm. Okay, so let's do our little tour. And, uh... Hopefully... No false door lies. Or worse, it's unlocked. As you, as you mash through everything. <laughs> in an attempt to not die. Ooh, camera shift. Down the middle. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, full circle. Full circle. Then starting door. Maybe that middle top that middle path. Middle path is the only path. And what's happening down there? What oh, isn't this a uh, ladder? A ladder. I don't know where it's coming from. Probably downstairs. This is terrifying architecture. <laughs> That's a really scary place to put a fucking ladder. And it gets louder, of course. Put the fear in. That looks like a boss room. Oh my god. Mm hmm. You are screwed. Thank you. In pieces. Pretty quiet. All you have to do is one pull up. <laughs> Might as well just die. Lighting change. Big rumble pack. Oh, yeah. Yep, 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 yep. What the hell is that? Excellent. Thank you. Big old Sarlacc worm dune. Fear is the mind killer. Yeah, keep your distance. When it opens. Uh-oh. Oh, it's stretching. Oh no, don't stretch, don't stretch. Is it crawling out? You ever see that meme of... Uh... Walking Dead Rick talking to Carl? And he's, and he's stretching his neck out up to his face? <laughs> Things, Coral! <laughs> Things! All right, that was okay, the butt. So it crawls from one thing to the other. Here it comes. Bang. One, two, three. God. And it's hiding behind all that foreskin. Oh no. You might be right. <laughs> 
anything that looks kind of like <laughs> it's thematically on point might be real. Shit. I hate it. I hate that. I hate that you might be right. This is the only time where it's like, it's not implied. It's like, overt. Oh! oh. I really hope she was like, feeling guilty about that plant she killed. <laughs> And that's just like a flower that is coming back to haunt her. Childhood memories. Hopefully. And a scene change. What? We're back. It's a shopping mall just like before. You good? Am I back? You're back. Red Shepherd slain. <laughs> what? <laughs> no. God. Red would be protected. Come on. It wouldn't. Anyway. 37 bullets. Nightmare circumcised. <laughs> And we're back right Real here law. in the middle of everything. Yes. Where do we go from here? I can't believe the indoor ball has a shuttered up uh, protection as well. I've never seen that. Big shutters like that? Shutters no, like the, not for, around here. for indoor yeah. malls is, uh, is, is, is new for me. That looks like a nice exit, but before I take that, let's just see. I think America and maybe some parts of Asia. Yeah. Because it's like once the mall's locked here, it's like the front door of the mall is locked. You're not getting inside, so there's not much point to, you know, mm. the shutters indoors. Sometimes you just have like fences with holes that they pull or whatever. Yeah, or the, the great yes, panels. yes, yes, yes. They do have the little fences and the small slight grating. That's true. I know, like the the grocery store has that. Mm. Newsboy. Newsboy. Ooh. Yeah, this is big. Okay, this is pretty big, and we got our safe spot back up there. Uh, okay, hold on. Already a marked, huh? Before I head that way, let's just try this out. What does that say? Accessories. Leela accessories, maybe? Happy Burger. The most American burger chain name you can ever think <laughs> of. Happy. Well, sorry. Whoops. Didn't expect that. Hard <laughs> progress. It's you. What just happened? You must be one of them. What did I do? Shoot! And what do you mean <laughs> by one of them? You're in on this with that Claudia, aren't you? Claudia? What about her? No her. She has to find you. That's all. So you are one of them. Claudia did all that? Look, I was just hired to find you. Did all what? I'm not on anybody's side. I don't know anything about this. Why don't you start by telling me what happened here? And that monster. What the hell was that? I don't know any more than you do. All I know is that things are getting really screwy around here, and I got a weird feeling it's got something to do with me. Maybe you're just an innocent bystander, but I, I can't feel sorry for you because you dragged me into this. You know, if you hadn't found me... What are you talking about? What's so special about you anyway? 
If I knew that, I wouldn't be so confused, would I? Fair enough. But I know there's something. Bagger track? Something I've been running from and forgot for a long time. How did I remember that? Nothing. Where are you going? I'm taking the subway home. What should I do? <laughs> well, what did I miss? And up, up on that, in that, in that area. Oh well, fuck me then. There's no way it's done, right? We're good. We can't go back, right? I have no idea, man. I don't have a map of this area. Too bad. <laughs> Fuck you. There's no way. <laughs> there was a safe point there. There was everything. Like, come on. There's no way the game's going to push I us forward, I right? Can't, I can't care. Because if I do, then I'll care too much. <laughs> can't you turn around? I, you saw me avoid the shutter yeah. to go the other way, uh -huh. specifically because I was trying to avoid to this avoid outcome, stuff. and it comes back around anyway. I, I can't care, because then I'll care too much. Um... <sighs> So moving on. Yeah, not even going to try. Not even going to try. <laughs> because old games will just constantly do this. It's just going to happen. There's nothing I can there's nothing I can do about it except for know the future. And I know that it's probably fine in the end, but it's still just like god damn it. Yeah. Hallway up there saves possibly some heals, maybe some bullets, you know. Anyway. Um what I was going to say is shout outs to a hey, shout outs to Minmo Cat Foods Minmo shout out shout outs to Comic Sans <laughs> and a basic bitch stroke growing strong and healthy Minmo Cat Foods available product availability buy and pack Packing? Packing by whatever. Select fine providers of cat foods. That's a big, strong, and healthy Minmo. Ow. There it is. Can't um, wait to fight him. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say that, like, really. Here we are. Better look at it. This, this many, uh, this, this by the third point here. The stilted, awkward, weird acting is a feature. And yep. if it was too smooth and normal, it would probably not feel like Silent Hill. I was listening to that and I was like, why do they all sound like Angela? <laughs> <You know? laughs> it's so awkward and weird. It's the it's the least human shit ever. But it's it's what somebody watching American movies trying to figure try, just hearing lines of dialogue in American movie style, just is gonna interpret sounds normal when it's just the weirdest shit ever. Reggie, what's wrong with you today? Who are you? I feel weird. Uh, well, anyway, I don't have time for this. <laughs> and it's just like, yeah, it's just, it's a feature of the fucking franchise. Um, you can't, you can't improve it with... Don't make it too good. Can't make it smooth, can't make it normal. Everyone's a weird fucking robot. To the point where, again, you can identify them in other games like Dead Space. Isaac! Make us whole again! Isaac, is that you? Who, who the fuck are you? What, what, you like, uh, what is this? You weird... I don't know you. Weird creature from Silent Hill. Yeah, I don't have a map. and we of course talked about uh, this in the previous games, but when we had um, Guy Sihi on the podcast years ago, who played uh, James, oh, he uh, described how when they did their line reads, they initially went for a, a normal human read, and they were directed syllable by syllable, word by word, 
on how to how to how they how to make each line sound and like the konami sound guy wanted it to sound a particular way and have a particular weird stilted rhythm to it and style um so they were not able to make it sound more natural i wonder how's the how is the japanese voiceover i don't imagine there is one i imagine it would just be subtitled i see probably like devil may cry but maybe there is there's no japanese dub yeah okay there you go a lot of games like that like again dmc era dante is dante is dante and you're just gonna put the subtitles up and they're gonna have to read the katakata for flock off feather face yeah <laughs> fez off face <-su. laughs> you know and then that's that's gonna be that in fact i want to say dante never had a japanese voice actor until <sighs> was it like marvel 3 or something like that mm. or no there's some point where it's like there was like you yeah it was marvel 3 yeah. yeah i can't get a ticket even when i put money in this ticket machine is broken there's a subway map here you're not gonna take it all right not good enough it's the station it's not it's, actual... it's not gonna help at all yeah Knowing where fucking Saint Michel is isn't gonna save you <laughs> exactly. when the monster's up your ass. Ooh, Lino Gru has multiple connections. Interesting. We also don't have these things in Montreal. No, we do not have the tourist towels. I think except at Place Place des Arts. Place That's des Arts the is the only station it. that has these. Otherwise, yeah. Which to me, I just see as like execution mulches. Yeah. Like you squeeze right in between on the wrong side, and someone pushes it the wrong way, and it's a medieval torture <laughs> device. That's the only. That's the only reading on it. Oh, grunting. Sounds good. I gotta get a pocket flashlight. Four. <laughs> Mounting it on my shirt pocket. I see. And not having to hold it. Why don't you just get those bandanas with the no, that flashlight looks dumb. on the forehead? And I'm not a doctor. Wow. So much so judgmental. I'm not a doctor. God. I feel like you put one of those on with a stethoscope and that's stolen valor. <laughs> You could pretend to be a miner. You know, digging coal. I, I just, like yesterday, I had to use a flashlight because the one on my phone wasn't good enough. And so I have a, like a better one, but I needed a, to hold it mm. like awkwardly with like my mouth or my neck. <laughs> so Fire doors are locked. They'd be tough to open, so forget it. If it's just going in and out, I should use a small door at the end. Boom. Quentin Tarantino? <laughs> Is that you? So, of course, in Silent Hill, the subways back home are also all empty. A, a big spoopy horror level. Oh. What is this? I read this a long time ago. It's a nothing little occult magazine. Seemed like a bunch of crap to me. It's not so bad if you just read it for fun, though. The souls of those who died suddenly by suicide or accident don't realize they're dead. Sometimes they stay put and haunt that particular place. These spirits have lost their human senses and memories and can only keep replaying the pain and sadness of the moment they died. The pain can get so bad that they turn to humans for salvation or they begrudge humans their lives. At such times, they can possess humans. Places known as famous suicide spots or high accident areas are often to blame. You should be careful when approaching such locations, especially on the day or at the time the death occurred. That is, if you don't want it to happen to you, too. 
Just a little fun light reading, says Heather. A mm-hmm. little bit of fun. I already read this. It's yeah. Basic. You know, page two horoscopes. <laughs> Mercury in retrograde. Don't Ugh. let the devils come in. Ugh. We got a memo finally. A cult, cult magazine. magazine. There you go. There you go. So, respect the high death frequency areas and um, be careful on the 300th day, perhaps. Meep. It's nice that they use a lot of the same sound effects too. Like that helps create a a mm. vibe to a franchise. Yep. You know? Not too lost. Keep the thread going. Mm. All right, now look. This is a Silent Hill subway station. So I'm keeping this gun out. <laughs> this so could also be a New York subway station. <laughs> so I'm keeping this say. gun out. <laughs> is that a monster from my childhood trauma psyche? Nah, it's some weird guy who's throwing shit. And he's trying to smear it on your face. <laughs> Send me back to Silent Hill. <laughs> Get the Glock. <laughs> I don't want to be here. Uh Uh-oh. Can't be caught lacking. When there's fucking monsters trying to smear shit on you. Yeah, I don't like walking on the tracks like that. I mean, like, just push me. If you're... Oh, God. (laughs) <laughs> that's the second time but that time it was real <laughs> that time it was real uh I guess we won't go there at least not yet <laughs> you know you would expect the vibe would be like horn shaking, panic, bah, bah. panic, 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 oh, no. find the exit. Find the exit? No. No. Just. Actually, dead silence, and then you, you pressed up. You died. <laughs> Death jam. What the fuck is wrong with you? Why would you press up? How dare you? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Tossing Manny into the, the, the... Wow, that escalated. Like, we're a bunch of fucking hip-hop fighters, and then D-Mob showed up, and now we're literally just murdering each other via subway. Holy shit. Uh, which path was it? Was it this one? To the door, to the book? Oh, no, wait, this is the different room. A row of phone booths, but they're all broken. Except ring ring. Damn it, we need a map real quick. Man, back in the day when you could call a public phone, that was wild. No, it's only for drug dealers. Um, At least I assume. Well, it kind of always was. (laughs) But, like, it was crazy enough that... uh, Colin Farrell could train a sniper rifle on you. Or wait, was he the guy in the booth? I forget. Whatever. I think, I think that was the guy, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and then you could just you could you could put Oh no, no, it was uh, Kiefer Sutherland was was the uh was the was the the bad guy. Oh, okay. Yeah, and they can fucking trap you in a fucking mid aughts thriller by just calling the phone booth and having some idiot pick it up. It could be anyone. Don't answer the phone. Phone booth. Man. That was just like... Yeah, that was peak. Peak, like, type of movie that Stephen Pil- uh, Scott Pilgrim was making fun of. It, uh, oh, okay. Yeah, it looks like we found the right path here.
Wooly versus the algorithm.